All right, so hey guys, I wanted to refilm this because on my stories, the audio was really messed up. Um, but so basically this is an ASOS swimwear haul. Um, so I ordered three different bikinis, um, two of them, I accidentally ordered two tops and no bottom and one top and, or sorry, and two, to two bottoms and no top. So that was a bust. Um, but one of them was really cute, but I didn't order it in the right sizes, so, um, uh, I ordered everything in a US 6, except for this one top that I ordered in a US 2, so, um, I'll just show you guys them on real quick. So I ordered this green ribbed one, um, these polka dot ones, and these tie dye ones. Oh, so this is the green bathing suit. It fits like in a flattering way, but the top is too tight. This isn't a two and the bottoms are too big. Um, there's like all this extra fabric in the back. It comes up like way higher in the back than in the front. And I just don't really like that. So I'm definitely returning this. I'm returning all of them, but um, you can see it's this nice ribbed fabric. It's not super thick, but I feel like it's a nice thickness if you don't mind like having your nipple show through a little bit, but that's kind of a personal preference. Um, I don't think the bottoms would be see-through at all. Um, but yeah, I had, I'm had i returning this one. But I feel like the... So they have this style in all different colors. I actually ordered um, like a red version. So hopefully that one works out. I ordered it in the four. But yeah, so this is what this bathing suit looks like. The straps are adjustable in the back, um, but there's no clasp in the back, you can see. So this so. is the next top that I ordered. This is also in a six. I feel like it's really cute, but it would have fit better in a four. So I am still returning it. Um, it does have this weird fold here where it's showing the inner lining and it won't like stop doing that. Um, this has the same style where the straps are adjustable but there's no clasp in the back. I think that's because it comes in size, in numbered sizes rather than small, medium, large. So I feel like um, that accommodates the ch um, not being able to adjust the chest width. Um, so yeah, that's this one. This one's a different fabric. It's nice and soft. Um, yeah. So this is the other top that I, this is one I ordered on accident. I actually, actually meant to order the bottom that was in the picture with this to go with the top. Um, and it's actually, this one's different than the other one. This one came with padding in it. Um, and it's like a it's, a, it's not as soft, but it is another ribbed bathing suit. This one does have a clasp in the back, um, but obviously it doesn't have adjustable straps because it doesn't have any. Um, <laughs> but yeah, this one's also pretty nice. I just don't really like it that much. I think it's cute, but I don't love it, so I'm just going to return it. makes me really it. sad. I really think it's cute, um, but I didn't order a top that goes with this, and it's sold out now. Um, this is the back. This is the same situation where the high waist is too high. Um, and this one's actually a completely different fabric than the other bathing suits. It's, like, stiffer um, in a nice way. It feels more like, like competitive swimwear-type fabric. Um, which is really nice, um, but I didn't get the top, so I'm stupid, but it fits kind of cute. So these are the last bottoms that I got. They would have gone, I wanted these with the top that I was supposed to order, um, and these are also a little too big. They're also the US size six, so you can see they're like crumpling up in my butt crack, so that's just not really flattering, but they're flattering from the front, but Nope, no top for this. So yeah, that really sucks. So I'll just do my summary. So yeah, I'm really glad that I ordered from ASOS. I actually already placed another order um, in the correct sizes. So I ordered everything in a US 4. Um, for everybody's reference, I'm a 34C and I normally wear small or medium in most of my clothes. And I wear like a 4 or a 6 in my pants. So I think they're generally pretty true to size. I feel like for swimwear in general, like you always want to go on the smaller size because you can make like a bikini that's 
like a bikini is really meant to fit you like in a form-fitting way so yeah I'm I ordered a couple other bathing suits in a size 4 I'm returning all these ones but I f I'm really glad that I ordered from ASOS because their um, ASOS design line is really really cute um, I really liked the fabrics everything seems to be really well made um, there's no um, weird weird threads there's no weird threads or anything funky with the quality like that um, I feel like they're really on trend they have those ribbed ones like the green one that I got in a bunch of different colors I got one in like a hot red like almost like a like a hot pink um neonish color um and I ordered a white one that's like shiny fabric in the same style and what else did I order um or I'll put a picture of what I ordered in the video but um yeah, I think it's really cool that they have the numbered sizes. I feel like that's more helpful to have more sizes rather than like extra small, small, medium, and large because you never know how that's going to go really. And um, they do have bra sizes for the couple of like underwire bathing suits they have. They have like a really good mix and match line. Like they have the same prints and colors in like um, like a strapless, bandeau style, triangle style, um, that knot front style, and the bottoms they have like a high waist, a thong, and a cheeky like regular hipster. So um, I didn't even look at the one pieces, but I feel like those would be cute too if that's what you're into. Um, but I am excited. They gave me free shipping on my free two day shipping on the new order that I placed. So I can't wait to get that and review that for you guys. We'll definitely give you guys an update. I'm sorry if I was not looking at the camera. I'm using my mirror to look so I can use the back camera so that I don't look backwards. Um, yeah, so thank you guys. Bye. Oh, wait, before I say that. Um, also, they're really affordable. And not like affordable Shein Zaffle where it's like $12 for the whole bikini. It's like $20 to $25, $20 to $26 per piece, which I think is really reasonable um, for what the pieces are. Um, so yeah, I feel like it's affordable, it's cute, it's fun, it's fresh. Check it out. Bye-bye, guys.